Decades after serving in World War II, a North County veteran is receiving one of the nation's highest honors. And he tells our tennis reporter Amanda Brandeis it came as a surprise, but he is grateful to be recognized. Well, wonderful. Sit in a room with Willie Pong and he'll likely bring a smile to your face. Thank you, honey. He's one of several veterans being honored at the Merrill Garden Senior Community. When he was 17, Pong lied about his age so he could enlist in the Navy. I was fairly young yet. I'm still young at 94. <laughs> he joined in 1943, serving almost three years as the ship's cook. We had about 10,000 people on this base, ovens wall to wall. Serving from San Francisco to the South Pacific. And then I was tying my white gray uniform and throwing it over the water to rinse it off. Then all of a sudden I saw a torpedo go by. A live torpedo. His parents were born in China and moved to America to give their kids a better life. But as a boy, Pong faced discrimination. I got scars on my head right now from kids throwing rocks at me because of, I was Chinese. Yet he leaped at the opportunity to serve his country. Oh yeah, I'm a true American. I'm a true American all the way. Now he and other Chinese American veterans are receiving the Congressional Gold Medal, the highest civilian award from Congress. A thank you for their valor and for defending democracy. I love this country. So much, he says. I love this country. He'd fight for it again. Amanda Brandeis, 10 News. How much do you love Willie Pong right oh now? Oh my gosh, I am smiling. He's ear to the ear. greatest. <laughs> that is fantastic. Once the medal is designed, a ceremony will be scheduled by Congresswoman Nancy Pelosi.